the white in the block traverse. Love it like the least. Alright, this is where we leave the tourists behind at Lake Agnes. We start plowing up some scree. The route goes up past that waterfall, traverses across the bench, attains the ridge, bags Niblock, comes across, bags white. Then there's the option to retrace and come down, which I don't want to do, um, or go over the other side and do the Plain of Six Glaciers Trail back to Lake Louise, which is probably the optimal plan. So, I'm going to switch from running mode to mountaineer mode and uh, do some route finding here. Just make my way through the avalanche debris. I seem to have completely lost everyone. Fantastic. <laughs> so the Niblock. Successful mission to be sure. All right, that's the pile of garbage that is Niblock. This is the pile of garbage that is the saddle between Niblock and White, where I'm heading right now, which is also a pile of garbage. That's where I'm going, pile of garbage. Garbage town, population me. I'm perched here in some surprisingly challenging fourth class terrain. This is the route. Goes up the stairs, but next to the stairs, there's no railing and there's a glacier with a cliff above it. Okay, my level of interest in down climbing this is less than zero. That was the sketchiest scramble I think I've ever done. Maybe the south summit of Mount Edith is worse, but that was miserable. That is loose. That is incredibly exposed. That is terrible. Don't, don't do this. Really? Summit of White. More or less, I passed the summit already. Um, I'm getting my plane to fixed glaciers view from up here, which is kind of cool. Now I'm trying to decide if I should go back the way I came or if I should try something down the spree. Down climbing some garbage. About halfway down. Nice. Time we are clipped up by a waterfall. All right, that's right now. The best. Not sure it happened, but I did come down this. Quite impressed with that. Nice. <laughs> 